All right, so this is the video on how to put a dumb body on a 99 in Z mod. All right. So you're gonna have to get the SCS extractor, which is in, um, which will be in the description. So boom. And then you go to your American Truck Simulator folder. Let's take this. We're gonna make a new folder. Alright, we're gonna call it dump, right? So we have got tech. We're gonna take these two, put it in here, and drag this on top of the extractor. Meanwhile, that's running. We're gonna take this missing, which is I will also be linked in the description. And this is basically all the materials for the chuck that will be missing. So. All right, now we're gonna delete the SCS and can delete the manifest too. And SCS extractor. So we're gonna copy and paste Control C, Control V over here. And then All right, so we're done with that for now. We can take this and put it on our, our desktop. So now we need a dump body. All right, so we're gonna take my 367 and take the dump body off of that. So there it is, drag it to desktop. Then we're going to open up Zmod, import, then you're going to go to your desktop, and it should be down here. So first we're going to import the 367 vehicle, truck, I believe it's under B67. We're going to import the chassis, and then change these directories to your your folder that you're working in so you just clicked on this so boom and put it there if not it will be a lot of errors and stuff like that so boom it's see no errors yeah man I, yeah see no errors no texture loss no nothing z and delete this guys yeah, you see it? So, all right, now we're gonna just right click on link and then on link the inside. Uh, we really don't need this, but you want the in there? You're not gonna see it. You want it? All right, so boom. Make sure it's still recording. So here we have the dump body. And I'm gonna cut out these pieces because we don't need it. You go into vertex mode up at the top and select and delete. And then you go back to object. All right, so we have the dump body here. That's all we need. You can right click, delete, and delete that. So now 
import. Then we're gonna go to the dump vehicle truck 99 chassis. Alright, so we're gonna make another one. Actually, we're gonna copy, paste, and we're gonna call this one. Yeah, can call this one two L two. Then we're gonna take L two. Then we're gonna do the same thing. This is crucial. Click on the dumb folder. The truck you're working. Every time you switch trucks, you gotta switch this. Alright, so now we have some errors, of course, we'll fix that later. Alright, default. Alright, so hold on, we gotta we gotta import clear this real quick. We gotta import not L2. Let's do just large, right? So boom, texture's gone and stuff, right? Fix that later. So what we're gonna worry about now is placement. Alright, we're gonna select this. And we're gonna place it where we want it. What you saying? Like right there? And just to get a visual, I'm gonna import the the cabin. What day cab? Yeah. So boom. As you can see, that's where the day cab would be. So we're gonna adjust it to there. Alright. Looks decent. So now we can delete this. We're gonna hide those for a minute, go into vertex mode, and cut out the pieces we don't need. Uh, no, they cannot crash again. We just don't need them, so. Like the fifth wheel and all that stuff, they need fifth wheel for if you have a dump truck. Alright, and delete this too, and then we're going to go back to object mode, select these nodes that are there, so the lights don't show up and there's nothing there, that's mud flaps, uh, that's about it that we need to do, right? Right, so I'm gonna re enable these, make sure it sits well. I'm gonna cut out a piece more. Yeah, no, no, no. I'll just bring it in. So boom, like that. Then we're going to chassis default. See? Drag these to default. So now when you click on default, it's all there. Right. Yeah, you just. You just hold all of them like this. I can take this head rack and move it. Just left click and drag. Yeah. But, yep.
So you need to dump bodies on there. Technically, we could export right now, but yeah, textures and stuff. So now, right now, we're gonna start sort out the textures. You can go up here to texture browser. Uh, is that right? And then we're gonna find these files. Let's see if they're in um, missing. All right, so I had a 99. Somewhere in here I have a international 99 mod, so oh, here it is. So I'm gonna take gonna take the textures out of there. Vehicle. See right here, it shows exactly where it's supposed to be. So we're gonna open up two. So we can. All right, then we're gonna go to this one. We have our one where we're taking the the um, textures from, and this one is where we're putting the textures. So desktop dump vehicle chuck vehicle chuck upgrade paint job paint job. Right. So we're gonna go here. Same thing. Upgrade. Paint job. Upgrade. Paint job. But, uh, it's not there so we'll just search it empty.eds not in here so. so we're gonna take it from oh boy so boom empty dds is in there What's the next one? Chrome underscore base. Material. Vehicle. Share. All right. So we're going to here. Go here. Share. As you can see, there's a DDS for every TLBJ. So the one... TLBJ that's there and probably doesn't have a DDS. So Chrome underscore base. We're gonna go here, look for that. Underscore base dot DDS. Once you find this, you're gonna open file location and then take these. Drag it here. Uh, it actually has both of them that we need, so we'll take these. This is the same 99 folder. So boom, empty. Alright. So you can go in there and replace them. We have a chuck shear. Right now, upgrade, paint job, empty. And then you have what? Chrome base, vehicle, truck, shear. And then you find Chrome base. And then we're going to do the same thing for chassis, chassis base. Then same thing for aluminum. Boom. And then we have one more texture issue, which is. Uh, what is that? Fuzzy underscore reflection. So that's going to go in material environment. Let's see if we have it in here. Uh, I'll send you my 99 pack so you can get it. But yeah, we're going to copy this, the fuzzy folder. 
environment fuzzy reflection as you can see here it shows us where so boom we take that i think that's all we're gonna need except a few files from where did i put it now right, we're gonna go to the 367 that we took the parts from Or when we, when we go in game, it'll show us what and what needs to take up. But for now, that's it for the dump. So all the stuff, look, you gotta replace this too. Dump, watch your environment, fuzzy. And it doesn't matter which one, but boom. See everything's back. No missing textures, everything, chrome, all that. Yeah, so boom. Now you're gonna wanna export. You're gonna go to dump, vehicle, truck, international, chassis. You saw how we did chassis long. We're gonna do that. And then we're gonna put a two. Or actually, chassis, and then we're gonna put a D. Right here in the name, you have to change it to the name. So whatever you have here, you must have when you're exporting it. Chassis, boom. Click on L so you get it, and then just put the D as seen here. Make sure this is right. This is right. Dump, right? Because you're exporting to the dump. So boom, and then click export. If everything went smooth, it should say this. Now you can clear it, and then you can, what I like to do is I like to, um, yeah, import it back, yeah. See, everything, everything's here, but, everything's here, but these files. So these files we need to copy over from. Over here, vehicle, truck, what's that vehicle? Vehicle share. Vehicle share. Yep. I'm gonna copy over share because that's where we got it from. Share. Vehicle truck. Ninety. And Ninety-four. Cause it says it right here boom and then lastly upgrade mud flaps okay. all right mud flaps and and this oh. I'm gonna skip Yeah. So UV editing will be your next video. All right, now we're just doing the dump. So boom, import it, and then look, textures are here. And then a few are still missing. Vehicle, shear, texture, metal, chrome. Okay, okay. So we're gonna go to our mod folder. You see how that, this one has TV, our DDS and the rest don't? All of them need a DDS, so we're gonna search for that, that DDS. Usually when you find it, you're gonna find all of them. Chrome base. Boom, aluminum base. I think that's it. Miss anything?
aluminum chrome rating. So we're going to import it one more time, make sure there's no errors. I like to uh, make sure there's no errors so there's no chance of it crashing. All right? Metal chassis base. I'm just going to go here, replace. Then go to share. Chassis base. Boom. Let me export it again because we changed the file. And then, since we made a new chassis, since we made a new chassis, what we're going to have to do now, we're going to, before we test it in game, yeah, we're going to um, go here, def vehicle, ignore that part, truck, and then we're going to go to chassis. And you see where it says chassis long? I gotta make a copy of that, right? And then we're gonna put chassis, whatever you wanna call it. But I'm putting chassis dump, right? So we're gonna open that. You see how right here was the old name? Chassis L, chassis L, chassis M. We're gonna put chassis. D. And then we're going to put change the name here, dump. And yeah, dump 6x4. We're going to change the model to D because we named it D. Change the PMC to D. And Remove conflict with that can work. We're gonna save it, close it. Yeah, and then test in game. We'll get back to you when we're in the game. All right, so we're starting up the game now. We're going to go into our mod manager. And then take off this. See it? Dump 99. And this is 99 pack that uh, I was telling you about. Mm -hmm. Alright, so boom. So we're in the game. Chuck dealer. And we're gonna go to what? Pick one of these. And then one of them say to say dump. Dump 6x4. Right now we're gonna disable everything but the dump. Right now we're gonna click on dump. And look. That is it. Right? So if anything, um, See, all this is here, everything, layers, all that. But if I enable all my packs and stuff, you get the bumper, new bumper, more stuff, you know? So we're gonna put that visor, can make it look good. All right, boom. Can make it look very nice. That is the next video, sir. 
that is the next video all right so watch this so the stock SCS um, pipes you see I aligned the dump in a way where it's not too close not too far so the stock SCS pipes can work on it all right can drop too bad pipe on it you see it yeah yeah it look like xbox for you man and that is it what come with See the head rack and stuff. If you don't want that, it's popping up. You can remove the node in Zmod. Just hover over it and hold your delete key. But yeah, that's it. I'll put this too. Boom. And then, if you don't want these, you can't X them out. Boom. Is it? In here, everything nice, everything crisp. So now we're gonna buy it and uh, show you guys how it works. Let's see. Yeah. Remember, it eighteen bars medium. So I'm gonna put on. Yeah, we're just gonna boom, Fred, Fred. Do the same for the rear wheels. Boom, setting it up. They look nice and good. And later on, you know, I showed you guys the basic texture and all that stuff, so you can you can import a light from a light pack. And then just copy, copy and copy all of them over here. All right, boom, like that. We're gonna show you. Can use the the dump truck loads, which will also be linked in the description for um for those of you who want it. Yeah, see. Let's make it. Let's make it daytime. Alright, six o'clock in the morning. Alright, boom. Everything's animated, everything's good. Stock yes, yes, you just added a dump. Also, if you want this to be removed, if you want this to be removed, you will have to uh, delete the node in the Xbox, you see a start on Xbox. Look, no crash, every not crashing, no every texture there and everything. So, yeah. Yep, so now you guys can build your own trucks and Yeah, so now, so now, um, I'm gonna do like a take up and take down, you see? And then, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching the video and, uh, enjoy. And send me pictures of your, your, your truck builds.
all right so that is the end of the video so like subscribe stuff like that you know the deal um if you want more modding tutorials just let me know you know peace